Hey guys, it's Joe again. Um, I have another uh, thing I wanted to show you regarding the Hubzin X4. Uh, this is the 107L. Um, if you didn't see my last video with the uh, wire management mod, um, check that out. I'll explain how to uh, basically tidy up your cable coming from your battery and a circuit board. Um, but anyway, what this video is about is balanced propellers. I'm not going to go through the balancing process, but I wanted to show you, um, or at least let you hear rather, the difference it makes between running standard propellers um, and propellers that are balanced. Um, these propellers that I'm currently running now are balanced. Um, I'm going to put up another video to show you how I accomplished that, but you can see it involves taking weight off of uh, one side of the propeller or the heavy side. You can see some sanding marks I have here. I, uh, I sanded the heavier uh, blade and then made sure that they're balanced. But I'm going to fire this up. I want you to compare um, an unbalanced propeller setup versus a balanced propeller setup. So this, this is the balanced. I'm going to turn on the controller and I'm going to bring it up to, I don't know, maybe like an 18 on here. I'm going to swap between the unbalanced and balanced videos so you'll be able to hear them side by side. Okay, here we go. Here's the balanced. Anyway, I uh, hope you heard the difference there. You know, this is probably more of a geeky thing to do than, uh, you know, you're probably not going to see dramatic differences in terms of flight performance or whatever. But knowing that they're balanced um, will probably uh, lead to longer motor longevity, right? I mean, if you're going to screw around with these things, you might as well make it as perfect as possible. At least that's the way I roll. Biatch! Alright, fools. Talk to you later. Bye-bye!